Oh, the sticky notes? Mm -hmm. What about them? Was it there before? No, why? Yeah, I'm not, I'm not supposed to. Yeah. Now, since security on me, I don't know where the hell I'm going. <laughs> this still looks cleaner than me plays back in the combat zone. I'm on the second floor. Probably not a basement. Hey, grab that. Get that. Wait, Wait there. there. This better be worth it. Allegedly. I think I probably told her to stay upstairs. Should be out here. Nah, man, we still at 3.45, man. Thank you. What about you? You going home? Allegedly. No. <laughs> he didn't have to say it. <laughs> Don't do it. Take that telephone. So I'm fucking radiation, I can hear it. Yeah. yeah man, purify water in a toilet. And dirty water in a toilet. Yes, I took the dirty water. You can turn dirty water into purify water or you can just drink the dirty water. Yeah. Ah, there you go.
Oh, I do not have security. Is that secure? Yeah, it's secure now. So you can shoot me or... You should have ate the free food earlier, you old bastard. <laughs> I don't give a fuck about none of that. <laughs> I don't care to read none of that. I'll just take all that shit and just leave. Twenty-four. Two. 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 <laughs> well, I'll see you. I was like, okay, <laughs> your, your your ticket has been completed. <laughs> oh shit, mini new. Is going to fucking explode and I'm going to die. Oh, really? So I'm going to outrun 40 something nukes exploding at once. <laughs> They're mini nukes. Is that supposed to make a difference out there? I don't know. You, you want to see what a mini nuke does outside? Kill a behemoth? Yeah. Hell no. Four of them can kill a behemoth, one of them just don't piss it off. Paladin, look at this place. You must hate these mutants as much as I do. Why do you hate super mutants so much? They're responsible for the death of a close friend, a brotherhood knight named Cutler. So when you ask if I hate them, I say hate is too gentle a word. These monstrosities are just another example of man blindly taking a step forward only to wind up stumbling two steps back. I've been fighting for years, trying to put a stop to this madness. And just when I thought we were getting the upper hand, along come the synths. I've seen what these super mutants do to people. Can you imagine what the synths would do to us if they ever got the upper hand? It would be Armageddon repeated, and maybe the end of everything that we hold dear. <sighs> Look, I don't mean to bore you with my rhetoric, I just want you to understand how important these missions are. How could synths bring about our destruction? If the synths reached the point where they outnumbered mankind, how long would it take for them to decide we were no longer necessary? They certainly possess the capability to make more of their own kind, so we'd become expendable. And with Institute technology on their side, nothing could stop them, not even the Brotherhood. It's a nightmare scenario almost too terrible to contemplate. Anyway, that's enough of that. What's important here is that you got the job done and secured these warheads. You should head back up to the Pridwin and talk to Maxon. I'm sure he'll want to debrief you as soon as possible. Dismissed.
heads up. Point out what you need and I'll get... You got a second. I got something I want to say to you. Of course. What's on your mind? Look alive. Look alive. Now that you've had a chance to roam, get back here on the double. Excuse me, Captain Kells. Now that you've had a chance to roam the Pridland, what do you think, Knight? Where did the Pridwin get her name? Elder Maxon said he took the name from a work of historical fiction. Something about a man who was destined to become a king, and his journey to liberate his people from tyranny and oppression. 